the uh, redundancy is, uh, it, it's about uh, a dismissal where it is not related to the, the employee. Uh, by that, it's not like there's a number of reasons, uh, fair reasons for dismissal, uh, such as conduct, competence, etc., capability, and so on. Redundancy is different. It doesn't look at that. It's driven by other reasons other than that of the, of the individual's conduct, behaviour, and, and so on. Right? So it's, it, 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 it's rather different. And therefore, there are, there are procedures involved in redundancy which don't apply anywhere else. Okay? So that, 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 that's fairly different. But of course, from an employer's perspective, because it is a dismissal, it has to be done fairly. If they get it wrong, if they treat people unlawfully, uh, if they discriminate unlawfully, uh, etc., then uh, an employee can, at the end of the day, uh, claim unfair dismissal uh, and uh, at employment tribunal. And may maybe, you know, maybe, maybe other claims as well, such as discrimination on grounds of part-time employment, fixed-term contract, sex-based discrimination, etc. So, the, the, there are all these factors to take into account. 